What's up, everybody? It's Charlie. If you heard it here first in my beer for tonight, they're both on Twitter. And this Saturday, a sunny day in July. And the best thing to do when it's sunny, it's hot, get some free time, drink. So that being said, you will have the pleasure to mob with me, walk with me, vibe with me, as I take you on a tour with me. I'm heading to Los Angeles. I gotta go pick up some beer from Modern Times. Not too far from Modern Times is another little brewery called Highland Park. When I make my way back east, I'm gonna stop at Arrow Lodge. Picked up some beer from them a couple weeks ago. It was awesome. And I wanna see what they have going on up close in person. And then when I finish there, what the hell? May as well stop by Kings and Rancho Cucamonga because I've been following them on the gram the last couple of days and they have been posting some fire. So with that being said, let's beer vlog. All right, what's up everybody? It's Charlie, if you heard it here first, and my beer for tonight. And I've made it to modern times here in downtown Los Angeles. Like I said, we're gonna be doing some beer vlogging today. Didn't know McKellar was about a half a mile away. So before I head over to Highland Park and um, drink some of their good beers, I'll probably roll through and see what's going on at McKellar. But I figured I'd start off with the Modern Times fifth anniversary beer. that this location is also like a coffee house as well. Uh, modern times, they make um, their own coffee. Which is alright, it's pretty fucking good if you ask me. But this fifth anniversary joint um, is basically a hazy double IPA with Nelson, Motika, Citra hops, um, got a little tropical flavor aroma, they say. Malted oats should be pillowy, mouthfeel. Um, so yeah, five years. And I think I've been fucking with modern times for about five years. I think it was like 2014 or something like that. So, um, yeah, I'm gonna wait for that beer to come here and let you guys know what's up. So check it out. Alright, check it out. Check it out, check it out. So, Gal just brought over a beer that I think I purchased this beer. They had this beer release, can release, last weekend if I'm not mistaken. But that sounds about right. Um, and as I explained, this is the fifth anniversary of Modern Times. So this is their fifth anniversary Double IPA, Jesus fucking Christ, this shit is juicy as fuck, I'm talking extremely fucking juicy, cheers. God damn, listen here, I have to drive an hour and 15 minutes away to get to great fucking beer. This Saturday beer vlog is gonna be about great fucking beer and me having a good fucking time. Excuse my French, I normally don't speak like that, but god damn it, this drink is good. I have a four pack, I'm glad I'm drinking it now. Can't wait to share it with my homies. At least one can or maybe two. I might be righteous to two of my homeboys, all right? Well, only I might only be righteous to one. But this joint is great, you know what I'm saying? Um, like I said, fifth anniversary brew, um, hazy IPA, double IPA, Nelson, Motika, Citra. It was brewed in San Diego, so, you know what I'm saying? They're sticking with their roots. Um, and yeah, that's it. So, you know, <laughs> one thing I can say about Modern Times beer is what I've noticed when I started drinking their beers, some of their beers look the same. However, looks can be deceiving because just because a beer looks the same doesn't mean it tastes the same. And there's a ton of their beers that, I mean, beer looks the same as the next beer. When you have them side by side, they taste totally different or different. And there is a difference. And this is what I'm noticing with this beer. I mean, if you guys recall, the beer I just had was the fifth anniversary Modern Times Hazy Double IPA. And I would say it looks similar to what's going on right here. But the smell and the taste of each beer, and I'm not even a beer reviewer, I'm a fucking beer consumer. And I can tell you there's a difference. So, with that being said, definitely.
Jack the Frost beer. Cheers to y'all. Brewed in a PDX. And um, yeah, that's it. I like that. I like that taste. I like that taste there. Anyways, let me get ready and finish this beer up, hit the head, pick up the beer I purchased, drop it off at the car, take the mile walk down the street to McKellar, have a quick beer, head over to Highland Park, check them out, do some vlogging there, go to Vinyl Shop, from there, back on the road, Covina, Rancho Cucamonga, we're gonna have some fun today, baby. So, um, yeah, once again, it's Charlie, if you heard it here first, my beer for tonight. This beer here was brewed in the PDX where I spent the last three years of my life. Shout out to the PDX. Not a lot of diversity, but it's a pretty great city. Death to false beer. I wonder who they talking about. Listen, if you're watching this right now, you tell me who you think they're talking about. All right? Put that in the comments section. I'm out.